do it. You scrawled on this video to do it. It's your boy, Daddy Scobar Dreamer. Alright y'all, we back with another big body banger, you feel me? Listen, today we got another cheating compilation, you know what I'm saying? I'll be watching, this is very entertaining to me, I'm not gonna lie to you. But this one, apparently there's this this video of this this wife that gets caught cheating with a younger dude. Now, it's weird, because it's like, that usually isn't what happens. It's usually like an older dude is caught with a younger girl, you know what I'm saying? But this time it's a younger dude, or an older woman, a cougar. You know what I'm saying? Raw. You know what I'm saying? Caught with a younger dude. You know what I'm saying? The dude in the thumbnail, right? I'm going on based off the thumbnail. The dude in the thumbnail looks about 16, 17 years old. And the, and the grandma look at least like 50, 60. You know what I'm saying? So I'm curious to see that video. Curious, honestly, I'm very curious to see that video. So if you're excited for this video, smash the like button. We're finna hop right into it. But before we do, you need to cop yourself a Jew rack. Because you could buy two and get them free, or you could bundle up to save yourself $80. Like, we got the best deals on deck with the best do rags on deck. What the heck else could you ask for? What could you ask for? Nothing. I'm giving it to you all. So tap in jordan.com, you know what I'm saying? Get yourself some heat. What is happening to this video, man? The worst couples ever. What it. is going on, guys? Shot Clips here once Shot again. Clips. And this video works, but you're also want clips of the worst couples I can find. Oh. Now, like always, my favorite clip will be at the end, so make sure to stay tuned all the way till then to find it. But in this first one, it is definitely not good either. I don't think this guy thought too much about this, but basically, I, I guess he really wanted to marry this girl while also being at McDonald's. So he decided to propose, and well, this ended up happening. No! no. In this next that's wild. That's wild. Honestly, listen, that's wild. Due to the fact that personally I wouldn't take that personally. But honestly, at the same time, it is McDonald's. Like, you couldn't think of nothing else except for McDonald's. Like, you really said, yeah, I might have taken this girl to McDonald's. We finna get a nice little faux for faux. Now, I might ask her to be my wife forever. And you thought she was just finna be like, oh, my God, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, my God, yeah. But at the same time, it's like, she shouldn't have done that whole thingy. She should have basically, she should have said yes. And then just been like, yeah, we got to redo that. Because that's not really the way I want it to be proposed to. You know what I'm saying? In McDonald's. But she, sh she shouldn't have, like, wilded out and all that. That would have made me reconsider. If you wilding out. You know that because because of the way I proposed to you when you could just calmly be like, yeah, I want to marry you. But now I don't want this to be the how the proposal, the proposal goes. You know what I'm saying? That's all she had to do. But hey, teach stay on. This one's absolutely horrific. Basically, there's guys interviewing random girls about the craziest thing they've ever done behind their boyfriend's back. And well, it seems like every single one of them had the same. In this is going to be good, bro. Because it's gonna be bad. It's gonna be good because it's gonna be bad. Answer, and I was absolutely astonished. Please check this out. What's one thing you never told your ex? I f his friend. Cheated before on him and he didn't know. He a mini man. I cheated on him. <laughs> I ain't never told him I dealt with a bitch while I was with him. I f his sister. I got a. Wait a minute. I ain't never told him I dealt with a bitch while I was with him. I f his sister. I got an abortion with his baby, it was his brother, baby. I f his oh, dad. nah, bro. Oh, nah. <laughs> wait, wait, that's wild. She, wait a minute. Wait a this is, where's he at? Because this is just a bunch of wildness. I'm not going to lie to you. First of all, he, she, she, she aborted his baby and she cheated on him with his brother. And aborted that baby too. She is ending generations. She is not even just cheating. She's cheating and ending generations, cutting ties. This is this is crazy. I ain't never told him I dealt with a bitch while I was with him. I f his sister. I got an abortion with his baby. It was his brother, baby. How f is that? That I Bro, this is wild, bro. Bro, this is wild, bro. His baby mom. Mama, baby. How is that? That I his baby mom. The baby mama? Like, could, are you supposed to be beefing with the baby mama? Not, not rubbing coochies. Like, come on now. What did you just say? <laughs> he cheated on me with her. I found out we had words, and then I went to her house, stayed the night with her, and then we had. In this next one, we have this guy and this. 
that was extremely wild. That was the wild. I need to watch that whole public interview because that, <laughs> that that is extremely wild. Girl, I guess they just got married. And I guess the interviewer wanted to know their body counts and see if it really mattered to them. I guess the end of the clip, the guy was definitely shocked. Y'all just got married, right? Just today, yes, like four hours ago. Okay. And do you guys know each other's body count? Yes. Oh, no. okay. no, body count, no. That's irrelevant. Is it? Yes, past is the past. Like, this is my future. Are you willing to admit it right now? Nine. Nine? <laughs> His face, bro. Hold on. Nine. <laughs> and this next one, I actually didn't like it at all. Basically, there's this guy and this girl, even though you really can't see her. They're, like, interviewing each other on TikTok, I think. And the girl really wants this guy so badly, saying, yo, I really like you, all that kind of stuff. And he just said no. But for some odd reason, she doesn't get it. But I get you don't want a relationship, but can't you just respect that I like you? No, I can. I do And you clearly you like me as well, because I know you don't really talk to a lot of girls anyway. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, bro. I'm not. I'm trying to focus on myself, in it? So that's what I'm saying. I'm not. Yeah, but you can to me. Bro. No, but it doesn't. Look, I'm just saying to you, I don't want a relationship. Okay, I get you don't want a relationship. Whatever. But I think it's gone past that. We do everything. Are we in a relationship without the label? So let's just well, forget stop. about the label, boyfriend and girlfriend, because that clearly scares you. Yeah, I've got commitment issues and I don't want to be in a relationship. So, so I would respect it if you stop saying to people that I'm all your right, man. Cool, I will stop telling people you're my boyfriend and I am your girl and all this, okay? And this next City boys up. City boys up. We have another guy interviewing these girls about the craziest things they've ever done. And like always, it's always surprising. Keep it all the way 100 today. Now, what's one thing you never told your ex? Uh, be honest with it. Be honest too. I slept with his father. Wow. <laughs> and this next one, what? this is this what girls be doing? Girls just be clapping they they significant others fathers. What if they clap your mother? Hold on, wait, hold on. What if your what if your girl cheats on you with your mother? I ain't I ain't never heard of that before. If anybody have like a video of that, that would be wild. That would be crazy. That is that, it's one it's crazy that your girl slept with your dad, but it would be even crazier if your girl slept with your mom. Like that that, 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 that is wild. Once again, another interview question, except this turned out to be completely horrible. I wish there was more to this clip, but there wasn't. I stole her earrings when she was in sixth grade. <gasps> that was you? I couldn't keep them, I gave them to my cousin. What's oh. something you've done? She doesn't know about. I f***ed your boyfriend two years ago. Is that why you guys broke up? Why? I'm sorry, can you go away, please? This sex was absolutely foul. This girl is horrible for doing this, even though I found it hilarious. Basically, she wanted to prank a boyfriend and did a little trick with Tuna, and you guys can get to where this is going. His reaction was absolutely hilarious, though. Please just check this out. Bro, come on. I don't need to add. What is this anime weirdness? It sounds like you'd be more persuaded if you saw me in my fox form. Wait, what's going on here? What type of... In your dreams. What type I am of... the Guji of the Grand Narukami Shrine. The purpose of... Oh, I thought she was gonna do something freaky. She's talking about you want to see me in my fox form. Like, what the hell? I was like, what type of ad is this? Hold on. Oh, she making her fishy coochie smell even more fishy, okay? I see what you're doing here. You need to put more than that, because... How's the movie, babe? Got a little surprise for you. You ready? This. A little surprise for you. What? What the fuck? Why are you making, <laughs> Why are you making that face? No, they don't. I just came out the shower. What? what? No, they don't. I just came out the shower. Literally. He mad. Come on, you ready? No, I think you should get back in the shower. <laughs> and this next one's absolutely... <laughs> Got to. Go back in the shower and bathe for real this time. What's so please? Insane. I think every guy would love to have this moment. Basically, this guy's ex hit him up after like such a long time. He ended up being super successful. And his conversation with his ex was the funniest thing ever. Please just check this out. Hi. You're my face now. Oh, 
Hello. Wait, you said what? Why you just went on mute like that? The last, the last time you texted me was in 2020. <laughs> because I've been busy. I'm wait. Why you on pause? Why you being weird? Oh no, nah, I was just going. I just going through my shit. You said what? I said why you on pause? Why you being weird? What? I'm, I'm chilling. Mm -hmm. How are you? How you been? Nah, I've been good. What made you try to? What made you call me out of nowhere? No, you can't, you little gold digging thought the honor. You can't call me. Nah, I'm up now. <laughs> <laughs> you on my dick. Yo, Alexa. Alexa. She on my dick because I'm up now. <laughs> 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 Alexa. Alexa. Put that bitch in the garbage. In this next one actually has nothing to do with couples. It was just a guy trying to flirt with a cop and I found it really amusing. Take me to fucking jail. Do y'all see her? Please take me to jail. Please die. Jesus Christ. Take me to jail twice. Take me to jail right me now. Me jail. Oh my God. Do y'all see her fucking God arrest And this next one is absolutely horrible. There was a girl. I guess she needed help with her Ikea stuff. So she said I'd hit up one of her. Bro, my nose ring just came out. Did y'all hurt? Oh, did y'all hurt? Oh, hold on. Okay, I fixed it. Oh, I can't breathe. For guy friends, to help her out. Matched this guy on Tinder, invited him over, and got him to build my IKEA furniture, and then kicked him out. And this next was absolutely funny. I guess just the Bieber really decided to go to the bathroom. Good game, hey, Justin. Guys. Are you a boyfriend and girlfriend? No. We're husband and wife. And this next one's absolutely wild. I guess this guy exposed his girl for trying to expose him on TikTok. Uh, I've got no idea what is going on. That's me. I sit next to her on a plane and um, she's made some TikTok saying I'm her ex-boyfriend. I have no idea who she is and she smelled bad. And this next one, this girl. Oh, not the stinky, not the stinky, stinky. Come on now. It was absolutely wild. I don't think that what the boyfriend is doing is a mistake at all. Basically, his baby mama needed a ride somewhere, so he decided to drop her off while I guess she was in the car and she was not happy about it at all. I mean, he still has respect for her. That is his baby mama. Like what? But she was uh, absolutely not happy at all. She was cursing up a whole storm the entire video. In a car look like a dummy. I was trying to do a con gesture. No, con gesture, my. I don't give a if that's your baby mama. She could take the bus. I don't care. She can take the train. Take, I don't give a f her ass right. walk. Take the she got a whole nother over here around. worried about this sh picking this damn guy. I don't give a I don't care. Yo, why, the the I, why am I even in this situation? You should have told me you was picking her up. No, I don't want to hear that shit. I don't want to hear that shit. You should care that he still be picking me up without Look, I ain't got time for that. You can walk to wherever the you got to go. And this next one. I'm not gonna lie, that's bad. He shouldn't have picked the drone up. You know what I'm saying? Only way that would be justifiable to pick up your ex shorty is if, like, your ex, your baby mama, whatever, like that, is if, like, your kid was there. You know what I'm saying? And, like, he, your kid had to go with the mama. Like, the mama had to go with the kid. You know what I'm saying? Let's say you saw them stranded on the side of the road or something like that. You can't just pick up the kid. You gotta pick up the mama and the kid, because then where you gonna take the kid? You know what I'm saying? Like, if they go, if they, if the car broke down or something like that, you gotta. Take them both up, but if you just picking up the shawty, you wrong. I agree with the girl here. She should be mad. She is mad for it's a it's a valid reason. She might be old. Well, I don't know if she old then, but yeah, she he wrong for picking her up. You just, why are you picking him up? And then the girl's also sitting in the back. She talking about yeah, this ain't even the first time he be picking me up when you're not even in the car. Like, come on now, that's bad. Yeah, a hundred percent, that's bad. You should not be doing none of that foolishness, my guy. But it's actually not that bad. I mean, I'm not sure how much of you guys care about shoes. I really don't care. But this girl found her boyfriend cheating, and the way she gets revenge is by doing this to his shoes. To be honest, it's probably one of the best revenge tactics I've seen. Forget creasing them, man. Burn them, Jones. Like, like put them up to the fire and let them burn up. You know what I'm saying? Creasing it, they could fix that. It could at least make it not look creasing no more. Burn the Jones. I'm telling you right now, put a little fire to it. It's going to be fine. She wasting her time he he and on and with these freaking Jordans and burn them. I don't got time for you quick. 
In this next one, it is insane. I did have to cut out a lot of stuff. Basically, this boyfriend caught a lot of things on his girlfriend's phone. She was cheating on him. I guess he was so mad. She was cheating on him? Her? That? Okay, let's... People hitting anything at this point. And he ended up like going crazy. She did hit him and then he hit her back. But I'm going to cut that out. But yeah, just check out this entire thing. Give me my phone. Give me my phone. Hey, your shit in my pocket. That's on you. Damn. That was a little bit of a scream, bro. Now, far for the best one on. That's a little bit. Oh, this is. I guess he skipped to when he had hit her. You know what I'm saying? I don't support any type of violence at all. He, she hit him, then he hit her. I don't think it's right either way. She should not be hitting him, and he should not be hitting her overall. But the dude on the camera talking about that was a little extreme, bro. Damn. That was a little bit extreme, bro. Now, far for the best one on the list, there is his husband. Oh, here we go. Here we go to old Tatiana. That was totally about the cougar. You know what I'm saying? Then he ended up catching his wife doing this with a younger guy. Let me know what you guys would do. That look like the most boring kiss in my freaking life. Look at this crap, bro. What the heck is going on here? We love this video. I think it's they made me wait all this time for that crap. That that that, 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 that stupidness. Anyways, man, that's the end of the video. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments down below, bro. It was a couple wild things in this in this video. Honestly, it was, it was the really the re, really like the wildest thing was the interview with them girls and they were saying what they did to their exes, sleeping with their dad, sleeping with their sisters, sleeping with their brothers, aborting the, the the they kid and the brother kid. Like that that that, that is od like super od. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. But um yeah, that's really about it. Make sure you like the video before you dip out, and I'm gonna see y'all. Hey yo, C3, so fly, hop out the butterfly. Wings to the sky, no, I'm never borderline. They choose I, cause I'm way above you. The waves make the haters love you when the ladies come through.